Are you in love with her or are you in love with me? You have to decide. I feel like the last time I spoke to you, we talked about how you were getting a lot of flack from fans blaming you for the Schmidt CC thing. And now it's so clearly not her fault. Mm. She broke up her wedding. She wants to be with him. What's, how's the reaction changed? Well, we're gonna see. <laughs> Yeah, it's interesting because Cece has made her feelings known and we pick up this season exactly where we left off. So Schmidt has to make a decision and it takes him a few episodes, but he gets there. What a nice surprise. I came to tell you that you can't come with me to the party tonight. They just told me that it's employees only. No sig off. Just say significant others. Well, maybe you have that kind of time, but I'm on a tight sketch. You also have to deal with the fact that she did sort of get left at the altar. Um, how how does that find her? Like being at the wedding, and then I'm sure you have like a lot of gifts to return. <laughs> Is there much fallout from that? <laughs> we didn't shoot any fallout from that, but I I remember at the end of that scene where uh, Shivrang runs off with. Taylor Swift with Elaine that I looked over at Zoe. I was like, I feel really rejected. And she was like, you were. <laughs> Which I thought was really funny because she, he thinks Easy has the power of calling off the wedding. And even though you don't want to marry him, you don't want him to look at you and say, oh yeah, no, me too. Totally don't want to be with you. <laughs> the Nick and Jess thing is sort of a huge deal. We're picking up right where we left off. They're together at the beginning of the season. As a member of the cast and also a fan of the show, how do you feel about them being together? I think it's great. I truly think it's great. It reminds me of in season one where Cece and Jess have their first fight. Cece calls it. You know, she's like, you like him, he likes you. It was the duck feet episode. Mm -hmm. And she's like, jump in, don't be afraid, go for it. And I think it's kind of a nice thing to, to see Jess and then, you know, go after something she really wants. Do you think there is a new girl that can exist where Nick and Jess are together and Schmidt and Cece are together? Ooh, I don't know. I'm not sure how it's all going to unfold. It's the thing I love about this show is I can never predict what's coming next. It doesn't feel like there's a formula in place where you go, oh, and then this will happen. I know that Liz Merriweather likes to keep things as honest and complicated as life can be, which is really fun for all of us. I hear there's something of a dramatic turn in the third episode of this season. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in season three, things start to come to a head with how Schmidt has been juggling Cece and Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. But in an unexpected way, I guess things kind of fall together or fall apart. Mm -hmm. Depends on, you know, who's talking. Yeah.